here's my newest change. I used to have my 10-foot John boat up here, but I got rid of the John boat. So now I needed some more space to, to have tools because this is all I got in here. So what it is is I did this setup. It's a 40-inch by 8-foot sheet of plywood. I set two horses down. I could lower it down. I actually had to put a crisscross of cables and one across the center to balance it out. And I sort of got to put the machines on to balance it out. But uh, it works fairly good. I put two stops up there to level it off and something it could stop up against. Alright, now I'll, I'll show you what uh, configuration of the, the cables. Right. Uh, all I really did was drill four holes in a corner. I got maybe quarter inch cable here. That should be enough. But it, there isn't that much weight here. And what it is on two ends, I drill the hole. Let me show you. Because I only had so many little, little cable clamps. What I did was I bent over the cable and put a made, made a little couple of things so they'd lock it in place. So on the four corners, two corners it's that. One corner over there. I did the same thing on the side. But across from the other side I got one of these clamps. So I can sort of adjust that cable. Same thing here. The other end's knotted. This side I got the little clamps. All right. Had a little fun balancing this thing out, getting it to the right location and everything else. So it, it balanced out fairly straight. Then the other thing I had to do was, right in the center I found the cross ones I had loofed over and had that cable through it. But these four going across, they kept would sliding. I had it. So what it is is, I got a, a little band clamp holding that on. Alright, again, Harbor Freight, lift. It's got the adjustable stop up there. These are just a couple of two by fours I screw, screwed to the ceiling. It goes up pretty good. Throw the cable up on top. And that's what it looks like. It's the newest project. Not much to it, but hey, plus two I can drop it down move those machines around and, and have sort of a workbench area. The horses, collapsible horses, I just put those away, get them out of the way. I got a room up underneath there to park the car in there, which is what I do when we head up north. So that car will fit easily in here. I'm going to be parking my scooter underneath it right now. There's my scooter. All right, that's about it. I hope you enjoyed it. All right, here's the finished project. Got my scooter parked underneath it. See up above. I got a jigsaw and I got a crosscut saw set up there. Step out of the way. I got enough room to walk underneath it. I can put more stuff up there, but like I say, you got to sort of balance it out. So it's it's laying level. When I want to use it, I'll just put the horses underneath, drop it down. That's it. Not much money. Twenty-five for the plywood. Eh. A couple of two-by-fours. The cable, I had the cable, but I don't know. Find some quarter-inch cable or so. I forgot what the lift's going for the, for the top, but I mean it's the, the smaller of the two lifts they say. You don't really need a big lift. That's it for this project.